What's going on volunteers? This is tip number eight. How to use technology to disciple teenagers. I know that screen time has a bad reputation, but our phones and devices are not going away anytime soon. So we can either fight to keep technology out of teenagers' hands, or we could try to reframe it in a way that makes it helpful instead of a distraction. Actually, what if we could help teenagers use their devices to grow in their faith? With a little intentionality, technology can be a great way to practice four key spiritual habits. Number one, spend time with God. Start a Bible reading plan with the students that you lead. You could use apps like YouVersion, and we actually have a YouVersion plan to go with every unit, so it's kind of cool. Apps like, you know, they can make reading scripture easier. They can have built-in ways to connect with and encourage each other. Number two, spend time with others. You know, some teenagers are on social media, some aren't. So what if we help the use those platforms to help them make deeper community? like leaving kind and encouraging comments, celebrating friends' birthdays, or having like actual real conversations about stuff that really matters. Number three, share your story. They can use their favorite social media platform to share what God is doing in their lives, or they can download an app for prayer and reflection. Number four, use your gifts. No matter what your students' gifts are, there are countless videos and podcasts and books and articles and other digital media resources that can help them use those gifts. So find, find some, you know, and then help them. Don't be scared of using technology. Instead, like help teenagers use their screen time to grow. This month we're in a unit called Atomic, Atomic, and it's all about habits. We're going to be learning about spending time with God, investing in your relationships, sharing your faith story, and worshiping God with your life.